I told my doctor I broke my arm in two places. He told me to stop going to those places. You're welcome. So today we're going to be experiencing a cold front coming through all of Canada. There's going to be an abundance of snow, minus 45 degree weather, and a lot of wind. I'm just kidding, guys. Anyway, I didn't mean to stop it on this, but it's funny right here. You can see it. It's a little tiny town in Ontario, Canada, called Coburg. And that just happens to be where Jeremy and I met. How cool is that? Now back to our regular programming. So you can see behind me, I'm working away at my last wall. I'm so excited. This is the last wall with any hemlock left on it. So just a few more pieces. We're going to take the TV down here in a few minutes. And then I'll be able to remove these two boards behind the TV. And what we're going to do is we're going to drywall the whole house. So we hadn't mentioned that yet, but that is our plan. We're going to drywall it. So it's still going to have that like farmhouse look. Our ceiling is pine. The walls are going to be drywalled, probably painted white or an eggshell color. I haven't really decided yet. Then we're going to trim out the windows and the doors with pine. And the trim along the baseboards, like along the bottom, is all going to be like a thick pine trim. So it's going to have that like rustic-y cabin, yet clean and bright, pretty feel to it. I'm really excited about that. So yeah, I just got to finish ripping down a few more boards. I'm taking them out to the garage. We're storing them there until spring because they're going to be used inside the garage. So once the warm weather comes, the inside of the house is done. We'll move back to the garage, insulate it, and then we'll reuse all of these hemlock boards. And they'll fit on there a lot nicer now because they're dried. So however we place them in the garage, they'll actually stay instead of shrinking and gapping. And it'll just be a lot better over in the garage. So that's our plans going forward drywall, trim it out. Then we're going to do the floors and we're going to do them probably in like a grayish color. They're going to be laminate. We're going to do laminate since we don't have a basement. That's usually the best option. We're going to do it in like a gray brown, kind of like a barn board look. So again, keeping the farmhouse appeal. So we're really excited. Let's get at it. all the wood to be reused. That's smart. You're putting them on well it's there. Holy stink, I didn't even think of that. You really and truly are a genius. I know. You are the smartest man of life. Uh, shoot. What? This one says R. <laughs> you put them on the wrong side. I just put them where they were placed. Well, that's the right, if I'm looking at it. Yeah, it all depends how you look at there it. There you right? go. Probably be all right. <laughs> it went in. Mm. As soon as you sit down. <laughs> nah. That's how yeah. they're supposed to go. Yeah, I think so too. Not it has in. To. They actually went in. Mm. I don't think it would line up if it wasn't. Oh, it says R right there. Ha ha ha. Hi, Gray. It's right there yelling at us. Gray! Gray! Get me out at me. He's moving. Yeah, I know. I understand. Yeah, we're not coming. <laughs> yeah. What's up, bub? Right here is fine, eh, for the stand for now? Or should we move it more so it's not in the way for when we wire? Should we move it in a little more? Since yeah, I'm putting I the TV would... on it now. Should we just move it? <laughs> should we just move... Go on up. Should we move it that way a little? To the middle of the... Jumping up. You are. There you go. Such a baby. Yeah. Hello. Hey, bub. Oh, gray. Want to move it in a little here? 
cool we put the tv yeah. on it yeah you're cool that way it's not in the way I'm trying to squish in that little hole to wire it yep okay oh. let's move this off it oh yeah oh i got the only important thing your skull <laughs> yeah i can put that maybe in the bath bit no bathroom bedroom. bedroom okay all right. all right, just kind of hold this side, I guess. Okay. Just falls on me instantly. You're dead. <laughs> I don't think from this TV, but you never know. Ah, uh, nails! <laughs> and what have we got to do? Lift it? You're going to have to move, Gray. we got to put a TV on there. Gotta move ya. Gotta move ya. Come and here. don't jump back up before we get back. <laughs> before we get over with the TV. She probably will. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. What do I do? Just lift? Out, out and then up. Yep. Right like that. No, Gray. I think it's pretty. Yep. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty bang on. Seems safe enough. Yeah. Okay. okay. That's not good. It's not the right one. Now that that's uh, stripped. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know what? I think I actually used the ratchet for that. Oh. I don't so, think I used is that in here. A socket? I don't think we have a socket big enough in this set. It's in the socket set. Which is outside in the garage. That thing? Yeah, like you need a fairly good size one. That might work. Worst case scenario, you strip this part. The outer part's still good. <laughs> oh, that's weird. That was loud. Yeah. You gotta keep those in a safe place. Yeah, away from me then. There's this Tape little ring together. here that goes with it. I'll put it in a baggie and keep it all together, maybe on top there, so I've been putting stuff on top of the closet. Okay, I should hold that, shouldn't I? Guess so. She's dead. Aw, oh, gee. Good timing. Charge that battery. The other one's over by the treadmill, isn't it, that I had the thing in? I think it's by the treadmill, because I was going to start doing that. <laughs> by the treadmill, the battery. Treadmill, by the treadmill, I think. I see you walk into the kitchen. Oh, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. No. I'm not really listening. No, I don't think so. Wow, that's so loud. That's like piercing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's solid, eh? Yeah. Like a rock. I never felt that strong. Like a rock. The air. Oh, gee. Okay. You're, you know what? I'm not showing that on camera. <laughs> this Real is being careful. edited out. <laughs> careful, a little twisty here. Yeah. Well, imagine how quick that job went if I was in one. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding, yeah. Everything's wired and in here we got my washer and dryer hookup. So I'm not going to be getting this for a little while, probably a couple more months because we want to actually do the bathroom. So we're going to drywall it and stuff and then once it's all drywalled and the floors are done then I'll think about buying a washer and dryer. But I got it all plumbed and hooked up and it's all ready to go so when I'm ready to get one we're all ready. So that's pretty awesome. So I've just been putting some insulation back in the walls here behind everything fixing it up it's a big giant mess in here along with everywhere else in the house but we'll get it all tidied up it's really cool now we have lights everywhere there's lights we are going to order actual light fixtures but for now we have lights everywhere so that's really awesome we at least have bulbs in places Good fun so we just have the bulbs put into the switch, I mean, right up there, which is awesome. So all the rooms have that. And when we get a chance, we'll order a bunch of light fixtures for all the rooms. So we're really tired. It's been a really busy day. We got a lot done. We're super excited. So we're gonna clean up the mess and then we'll give you like a full overview on all the electrical stuff that we did in the next video.